Hello, candle lovers. Thank you so much for joining me today. My name is Greg, and this is All About Candles. Let's get into today's review. This is Pumpkin Cinnamon Bun from Bath and Body Works. Um, yeah, this had a cute lid on it. Looky there. Really cute with all the little, like, ice cream cones and cakes and stuff on it. Um, not super impressive label, but it is perfectly acceptable. Pumpkin Cinnamon Bun is one of those Bath & Body Works candles that I consider to be an old friend. I pick one of these up every year, and when I am in the mood for it, I always really, really enjoy this one. It's been around for a long time. I feel like it's always extremely consistent from year to year. The notes on here are warm cinnamon roll, pumpkin spice, and vanilla frosting. I take issue with those scent notes. There is very, very little evidence of any sort of pumpkin or even pumpkin spice being in here. Vanilla frosting? Vanilla frosting doesn't make sense. It is a cream cheese frosting. I get the warm cinnamon, I don't get the warm cinnamon roll, all right? All, all I get from this candle is cream cheese frosting and cinnamon. I really think a lot of people agree with me on this one. Like, this is not a super complex candle. I don't pick up on that much pumpkin spice even. I don't pick up on pumpkin at all. It says warm cinnamon roll, but I don't even really get any like starchy or doughiness from this. What I get is, you know when you're in the mall and you walk by like a Cinzano or a Cinnabon or any one of those cinnamon bun shops, that's what this smells like. Um, without all of the starchy doughiness, like what you really just get from this is cream cheese frosting and cinnamon, end of story. It is a very mid-range candle. It is very one note and that one note is cream cheese frosting. So if you are into cream cheese frosting, which I am, Ooh, this is a good one. I always say I have a sweet tooth in my mouth and in my nose. And once in a while, this really hits the spot for me. I just love it when I walk past those like cinnamon bun shops in the mall and you get this cream cheese frosting fragrance. And it is actually a really nice cinnamon note. It doesn't go red hot cinnamon at all. It just sort of kind of helps balance out that super lactonic, cheesy, creamy uh, scent note that you're getting. This candle performed really well, you guys. I would say that the strength and throw on this is a very, very solid 7.5. And that is in my more open area, a strong solid 7.5. You don't need to search for this fragrance at all. I even, I did put it in my bedroom for a little while and it was definitely like an eight in my bedroom and it was actually a bit much for me. So I mostly just burn this in a more open area. It's just so sweet and ooey gooey and delicious smelling. Oh, I love it. And it was really, really strong and it performed really well. I know that this wax looks pretty murky. That's my fault. I'll cop to it. This had thick ropey wicks on it, but it, it burned really nicely and cleanly and strong all the way down to about this point here. And then I left it for a lot longer than I should have. You know, that just kind of happens every now and then. I think I was talking on the phone one night, actually. It got a little bit carried away catching up with a friend of mine. And next thing I knew, I was like, <gasps> the entire thing had like liquefied all the way down to the wick nickel and it got very dark and swirly. So I burned this one for way too long and that's why it looks the way that it does. And so I kind of ruined the last quarter of the candle for me and I called it a day, but the first three quarters of it performed like it always does. Very solid performer, very strong, pulls out quite quickly, does really well. This is a real standby. I feel like it's a definite staple in the Bath & Body Works fall collection. I think it's been coming out every year now for quite a while. I almost always pick one up and I do quite enjoy it. When I'm in the mood for it, I reach for it and it hits the spot. 
Mm, pumpkin cinnamon bun. Mm, cream cheese frosting. Mm, I want some cream cheese frosting. <laughs> That's all I have for you folks today. Thank you so much for watching me. I really appreciate it. You should hit me up with a comment. Let me know what you think about pumpkin cinnamon bun. Uh, if you could like this video and subscribe to my channel, that would really mean the world to me. You can follow me on Instagram at allaboutcandles and email me your burning questions at allaboutcandles at gmail.com. And until next Next time, my beautiful, gorgeous, candle-loving friends, let's burn some candles and bitch about it. Thanks, folks. Bye-bye now.